will improve uh, transport automation system in India. And just I have just started uh, looking at. Maybe after some time I will be able to give my reaction sure. while I am going out. Uh -huh. But uh, initially, it, uh, I feel that uh, these kind of workshops uh, uh, will give awareness uh, to the clients as well as to the uh, ministry people and uh, the uh, co player like transporters and all other uh, police, traffic mm -hmm. police, all those people. It's a good initiative. It is in the traffic check for 2013 in the sanitized sea each one of them is full of innovative solutions for traffic management and city transport In fact, this is, I hope these are all cost saving also as they have reasonably convenient to manage and operate. I also hope that it will be technology suppliers to partner with domestic institutions not only to provide the equipment but also for imparting the capacities to operate the equipment effectively and useful. It complements the organizers, that is the traffic as well as all the participants. Maybe the th third uh, day is more uh, convenient for us uh, than okay. the first day. So what more products you would like to see probably we can incorporate in the next edition? You know, you would like to see show. Maybe th third day we can uh, able to answer your questions. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sure, definitely. So how, as of now, what is your experience? It's good actually. It's, uh, it's a very uh, new, new safety, uh, technology safety. comes comes up and a uh, lot of cameras which is there. So uh, it's, a, it's a good thing for our uh, for infrastructure, city infrastructure definitely, parking system as they were talking about, that's a big challenge in all the major cities. Okay, thank okay. you. And can I have your uh, name? My name is Rajesh Drover. I am also from the same company, Island of Fist Transportation Network Limited. Uh, two, three things uh, I have to tell. One is uh, law should, uh, uh, now the time has come that uh, um, lawmakers uh, should make uh, appropriate laws as far as uh, metros are concerned, as far as uh, uh, towns are concerned, as far as uh, districts are, some cities are concerned. They should make, yeah, they should make laws where, with respect to um, uh, either parking or uh, I would say See, uh, roads. Integrated, uh, what, uh, what the public sector can, uh, can benefit out of it as well as government. There, there is three stage of uh, institutional setup which should be there, should be in, uh, in, uh, in place, so that everybody will benefit out of it. Mm -hmm. Not only the government will see, you know, I will stick to my uh, uh, code <laughs> norms and all. Private will will be, uh, be, these people are also benefiting because see there, there are a lot of informative technology which is coming up. There's uh, there's technology which is coming. Up. So government will take the benefit out of all these things. You all this this approach is very good for making both both the parties in the same platform. Okay. I'm from Gujarat basically in Baroda. Uh, the sh there are shops. After shops there's a footpath. After footpath there's a specified two wheeler parking space with one uh, uh, with one person going in between two scooters or two 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 wheelers there is a one person there is a space to go inside so that one can uh, take out his vehicle 
so man, the system also uh, man, so you say there is something the, wrong in the planning yes, as well, the way we are yes, planning our infrastructure yes, yes, we have yes, to start from there yes planning yes ma'am so i expect to see you on the third day again yeah, yeah <laughs> yes <laughs> yes you will be yeah, yeah okay, thank be, you yeah. it actually it's, it's dealing with cities it's not dealing with individuals it's not dealing with corporation it's not say that i want windows for my house or you know you want shoes for your the wardrobe is not dealing with individual this is dealing with cities so a trade fair like this where the audience is the city is already a complicated thing so you need a platform where city issues somebody does an analytical presentation of city issues and says okay now here's five types of technologies that i'm looking at i'm looking at intelligent traffic flow management and looking at intelligent management of parking space available it's an application of a principle called cybernetics which is to adjust your behavior according to a feedback of information and that is the key i think that's the central scientific key to managing public affairs adjust your behavior according to feedback of information uh, i think that's where we have to head okay. <laughs> there are a lot of things in the in the exposition that we are looking for so that we can integrate those issues those things into our system uh like flashing screen doors and there then sensors those things are required for by us to actually do and that's how we are analyzing this technology here so that's quite useful and that's one of the good session with the peer and to provide us a good platform for tracking them and so that once we are in the construction mode we would be seeking uh, so you see a lot of probably the lot of vendors with whom you can partner yes yes really a lovely platform the only suggestion from my side is you should involve more case studies the real life case studies that the a particular area faces a particular problem and how they sort it out so that the people can learn from it. that type of thing should be more incorporated in the next stage but it's really a good platform where the interaction of a, a vendor a policy maker and a technology provider and the stakeholder the local people is really good. to know the yeah. feedback so that we can always improve uh, our it's uh, good for you know, both uh, urban transportation sector like road way and rail way that everything is under one roof okay. it's a great opportunity to know about the technologies the upcoming technologies and technologies to provide for travel screen question like they form screen door we have it on airport line but we don't have on the mrc network okay. that is essentially required for travel screen okay. so we can have something of that kind and many safety features security features are required in travel so you found it useful it's very useful like parking management is really eye opening you can go for some solutions of parking management we have limitation of space on for parking how to increase uh, how to go for the multiple parking automatic parking automatic parking multiple parking that we can do so it's really